What's up? This is HG News here. So here is my Apple Macintosh hard drive, you know, data, how much this I used up and you know I think I can actually um there's up with this image. And you know this is the Mac OS disk I made, so just in case I ask you run on a PC. There's a way to do it, but apparently who knows? I'll see if it works. You know, it's the install image that is on your download from the app store and you'll load it and you'll see it in applications right here. It's a disk image, so you know it takes a while. It was DVD, supposed to be a DVD, but Whatever. So at least they don't usually make them. They use them. They make them as an app now, and in order to get a Hackintosh to be built, and if I get the money and I get some things paid off that are needed, like things more in need of actually replacing. I mean, having you know paid off. Sorry, I woke up with a sore throat this morning. Valentine's Day. Cause the crazy weather in this state, so yeah, kind of fell under the weather. It was like that last month I had strep, and it's like mm -mm. I'm talking all this morning. We're down with time. The thing with my illness, I got with hemophilia A. I can't take no aspirin, no leave, nothing like that. Just Tylenol, and that's the only mess I can actually take. Cause any other, it'll thin my blood, and I'll end up having serious bleeds or end up passing away and dying and I don't want that so uh, yeah him as, him as hemophiliacs can't take those medicines until there's actually a cure for the disease unfortunately you know that developed this is a generational disease to the family and just how it is you know so I got the, I got like this, this is the main backup drive, this gets all my data up to the Mac, and this Mac's going to have to be upgraded, I'm afraid. I mean, it's easy to make a backup, but you know, there is a website I might link that's still active for hackintoshing, and there's others, and they have this, these bootloaders. Clover is a bootloader that's for Windows PCs only. This Mac doesn't need it because it's got it built in. So, yeah, I mean, I think there's like that one where I said I'm going to put it in Tony Mac, wherever, 86, you know, credits to him and all that. But I followed some of his videos you know, in the past, and you just can't boot this OS on a Windows PC without any special software. And there was a company who actually got in big trouble with Apple and lost a lot of money because they were making clones of Apple machines and selling them with the OS loaded. That was back in 2007, 2006. Pystar, if you don't remember them, they were having a bootloader installed when Intel, they were back when the Snow. Uh, Leopard was out and the new, you know, the Macs were switching to Intel. A lot of those clones were Intel machines with special software and all. And that were a lot cheaper. But they got a lawsuit. They lost a lot of money. They stopped their operation. There's been companies like that. You know, you gotta be watchful. You can't sell a machine with the uh, Mac OS on it. That's just not allowed in the US law and you know it's for Max but you know people also began to buy with running on machines that are not actually Apple branded. But it does work, but you know, you always run at risk of, you know, having Apple release the update. They did release updates in the past that damaged Components when Steve Jobs was alive, as you know, they would just have at least one update, and a lot of their things were broken. I mean, they they basically delete certain things, and so yeah.
So high speed, I got I got new wave in here around here, and I'm, I realized that I'm actually getting a $55 plan for 100 megs, but now they offer 10 megs upload with it in the same data cap and 10 um, and, and then 100 download for the same price. So I'm actually getting less than they offer now. I might have to go to the parents and they own that account. So, um, yeah, they also offer a unlimited data, but it's 40 bucks extra. And you plan unlimited. So, you know, your wave is kind of flexible plus. Turbo 300, you know, that's like the max price is like 80 bucks. You imagine adding 40. 300 megs and then what is the dirty upload <clears throat> for another five bucks I think I can ask over ten dollars I can go to 200 megs download and 20 upload which would help on video but 65 I've not hit a data cap um, apparently probably there's how they know they I should look at it's like nope you know, just haven't hit the data cap. So whatever. Glad. They said would every three months they had asked you would have to bump you up a plan. You know. I haven't got the bill for this yet for oh the updated the uh, internet rates. In the second of January this year, so that and the, the first was this month was the TV rates. So, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. yeah, TV is expensive. What is television? It doesn't really tell what television is. I think they're gonna go most likely the internet the next. Five years or so. So, for customers who ask the data seeds, plan is extra 10 per 100 gig block uh, applied 50 billion cycle. Oh my god. That's not good. So if you're a seed, so you got 10 extra. So you can actually charge you another 50 bucks for data. Oh, Jesus. Oh, that's not good. That'll somebody get a whole plus 100 bucks. Huh. Oh. Still, it's your pain. Yeah, whatever. It's not a video about. But you know, I just had that. I guess I was looking at it like, oh boy. Well, at least they're not like Verizon. Verizon was far worse, trust me. Or worse than that. So, whatever. If you're new to the channel, go ahead and subscribe and comment and like below. I'm actually using a headphone thing. I got a 20, a, a eight foot uh, monster audio cable onto a headset. Bluetooth, see how it actually looks better. You know, let me know, share. Make sure you actually push the notification button so you actually get notified. Every time the video comes out, I release it's that bell button at the bottom of the screen, right side. So, yeah. well, see ya. HD News signing out.